Morning! Except it's afternoon. Did someone sleep until midday? I need more! <laughs> <sighs> we are going to the Sweethearts um, after hours event tonight, which goes on to 1am. So we knew we didn't have to rush out this morning. Um, but it is now lunchtime. We had a little bagel and croissant ensemble a couple of hours ago. But in the meantime, we're going to formulate a plan and, you know, Hopefully sort this out. I'm not sure if Gary's having a moment with Walt Disney or... <laughs> you know what I'm doing. <laughs> <laughs> having a moment with Walt Disney. <laughs> Let's get physical, physical. I wanna get physical. <laughs> Let me hear your body talk. Mm. And it says... <laughs> <laughs> We've decided we're going to head over to the Grand Californian via Downtown Disney. Go and have a little Momo Road. And have a look at maybe their quick service, get some lunch. And uh, the cast member that we've met on this trip called Liz, she said that there's a lovely Disney Vacation Club thing that was right up my alley. So, you know, might as well have a look. Don't mind treating myself. <laughs> I'll treat yourself. <laughs> That's the star, he follows his dream with mind and heart. Wow. Listen to what they're playing. <laughs> Out there. Oh! Bring on the tears. Dun, 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 Oh, look at that! Well, that's the thing they're building out of um, fondant. The Grand California to me is like if Grand Floridian and Wilderness Lodge had a baby. It's very cool. We're currently building a sugar sculpture handcrafted by the pastry team for the Disney 100. Very cool. And they're currently making it, so this might not be the finished product, but the characters look fantastic. Acorns, gifts, and goods. <laughs> I love that. Gifts and Hello. goods. Hello. Ooh, they've got some nice stuff. Ooh, Grand Bay. Grand Did Californian Hotel Bay? and Spa. Oh, I love that. Shame we're not staying here. Do we, do we have one of these, like, one of these types of things in the Disneyland Hotel? Uh, maybe. Might I love look. the fact that this has its own ornament. That's very good. Not just any ornament, I think that's a proper sketchbook one. I like this tile as well. I think this is what they put in the bathrooms. <gasps> what a nice touch. I think so, because I've looked at room tours. Because <laughs> it was between this and the Disneyland Hotel, but the Disneyland Hotel was slightly cheaper, and the reviews are slightly better at the Disneyland Hotel. Not that like, this isn't bad, but you know what I mean. If you like Loungefly, this is a beautiful bag. It's got like a faux leather texture. Mm. This doesn't look as good on camera in pictures as it does in real life. It's really solid. Yeah, you 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 shaking things that are fragile freaks me out. Blizzard! <laughs> <laughs> For all you disco divas out there. <laughs> what was the song in Mickey Minnie's? The Disco Mickey, yeah. Disco Mickey Mouse. <laughs> And this really is disco. How much are these? These are twenty nine ninety nine, so they're the cost of like a medium plush. I just like the novelty of them. The fact that they like. Oh no, I remember. Disco Mickey Mouse. That's oh yeah. <laughs> disco Mickey Mouse. The spirit jersey is really nice. Hey there, pal. Do you want to buy some merch? Not for eighty nine ninety nine. I don't. Don't be cheap. <laughs> I will treat myself, but I will treat myself on things that, you know, go on, I think I want more. Go on, go on. <laughs> I love that shirt. Yeah. How much is you? How much is you? $59.99. What do you think? Yes, I love it. That's really nice. $60. Um, Christmas ornament. And it lights up. Ta da! Oh, that's good. But the thing is, it is 20, 29 .99, but I do collect sketchbook ornaments. Like, you're probably thinking another thing he collects? Yeah. <laughs> a whole big yeah. box thing. I've just never shown people them because it's like, where to start? <laughs> but um, 
Yeah, I really like this. This is like the perfect keepsake from the holiday. It's pretty good. Eighty nine ninety nine. That's good. You sold me. <laughs> there is no way we could put that in the case. No. And look how big it is compared to me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'd love to be able to get that. <gasps> Flynn Rider. Oh, he sold. <laughs> Very nice hotel. Very nice. But it comes with a price, dearie. Or slightly more pricey, the big advantage of staying at this resort is that you get the Disney California Adventure entrance so you don't have to go all the way around to the front of the park you just walk in from the hotel we've got a spa Ooh. very nice i do like a massage i don't this is where the lovely cast member directed us to craftsman grill let's have a little mumu charu let's have a look Ooh. oh yeah this will do we've ordered indoors uh we've got a little number I've mm. gone for the baked chicken nachos, which we can um, potentially share, but he was like, they're really good and I would recommend getting them. So I just got them anyway. Um, Gary's gone for the impossible meatballs and special plate. Disney 100. I love it. It's very nice out here. Um, all of that together came to 43.64 with a 10% DVC discount. I think that's quite pricey for a quick service, but we'll see if it's worth the money. Um, so, we think we've figured out why it was a bit pricier. <laughs> You're never going to eat again. <laughs> That's Gary's um, impossible meatballs in a bread bowl. This is my nachos. He did say it was enough for two people to share, and so this is the he size, was right. <laughs> this is the size of a juice, juice box. Yes. So, I mean, we maybe could have just got that to share, or just that to share, but oh well. Just try some of Gary's meatballs. They taste even better than normal meatballs. They do, they're really, really nice. But the marinara sauce is amazing. Out of five? Five. Five? Nachos? Oh my god. Mm. Great. Exceptional. Oh, Gary. I went to the restroom to clean myself up and get all the meatball-y stuff off. And once I was washing my hands, I just flicked water all over myself. But not on the stain. Literally all down myself. I looked in the mirror and I was like, what are these two massive paw prints? Did you not look in the mirror and think, what am I like? No, I just sort of sighed and went, here we go again. <laughs> this is it. Crossman Grill. Five. Five out of five. It is expensive, but I think if you just split a couple of things, it actually wouldn't, it would actually be cheap and you'd also get a lot of food to try. Yeah. Really so, nice. family of four, get two dishes. Two of you, get one. In my opinion, or just like a lunch thing. We're going to pop into World of Disney because apart from the stuff I bought for the competition earlier in the week, haven't I really shopped much? We've got the free lanyards and the pins. You bought loads of pins, obviously. But uh, I, want to have a, I want to get something to like Disneyland. I keep seeing these notebooks and I love them. So nice. And they've got the stories in front, inside as well. Let me tell you a story about Cinderella. Once upon a time. Sleeping Beauty. <laughs> <laughs> in a faraway land, long, long ago, lived a king and his fair queen. Sounds familiar? $34.99. Yeah, they are. But they're very nice. If you had, like, if you were going to use a notebook for a really special reason, I think that would be nice. But my problem is I buy notebooks and then. <laughs> no, I don't either. I do the exact same. And I've seen these pins. Oh, they're good. Um, I bought one for me and one for my friend Brogan. When she went to Disney World, she picked me up loads of things I couldn't get. She never managed to get a Disney Land on when she went. So, there's fair girl. They've got these shoulder plush things where, like, you put a magnet in your T-shirt and then it sits on your shoulder like that. I really love these. That's really cool. So they've got a hey hey. They've got the uh, armadillo. From it's, Raya? It's, oh no, it's the 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 uh, it's the, it's a fantastical creature, and they've also got a I, I want to say a Halebrea. I can't remember. Halebrea, something like that. But they do also do a Remy the Rat as well. I see a fancy doll box. Would you be so kind? Whoa! Wow. They're cool. They are lovely. Comes with some collectible cards. Very nice. How much How are they? Uh, $299.99. And let's close the box. <laughs> I see, see the, the price, price I put it back. back. Lovely t-shirt. It's 
Very nice. I so, like it. Something to remember the trip by. It's a thin material. But you want that if you're going to wear it in Disney World. Because it's going to be hot. It doesn't say how much it is. My favourite game. Play the game. How much do you think it is? Uh, I say 22.99. I'm going to go 29 hours. I don't know. Okay. We will return after this message. Hello, my name is Gary Saint. Give me the camera. Disneyland 100 t-shirt for 29.99. I swear I haven't seen this. No, I haven't seen this anywhere. I've seen a purple version of it. But this uh, one has Disneyland as Oh, well. I know why. There's only smalls and extra smalls left. <laughs> And that ain't us, unfortunately. Back in the days, maybe the 90s. Was you a teenager in the 90s? I was. <laughs> they're quite fun, aren't they? Yeah, they're very cute. It says on the back, 100 years of wonder. I think you can get those embroidered as well. Yeah, you can. <laughs> Not with the string. I love this collection. This is great. Plain and simple. I, I like it. Pop one of these. That says it's a large, it must be a kid's. That can't be an adult. No way. That one looks like it's an adult's t-shirt though. Got some cool Disneyland merch here. They've got a photo frame. How much is the photo frame? $24.99. $24.99. I like this t-shirt here. How many coins? You are... Well, oh, they have a mask though. Oh, oh, okay. A bit much. A bit too much. <laughs> Absolutely beastly dark. Oh, the clap on that. <laughs> How much is the fan? Oh, it doesn't say. No. It whacked me in the head. It won't go in the vlog though. Um, so I'm just going to pop down to the shop to return a couple of things. I've got World of Disney. Um, the sizing over here is really random. So I'm a large in one type of t-shirt, but an extra large in another type of t-shirt and a medium in another type of t-shirt. I don't know. So my advice, try it on. But the good thing about being in a Disney hotel, having bought something at, at World of Disney, is that I can return it to the shop here. So you know, don't have to go all the way back. Perks! It is now time for Sweetheart's Night! Hooray. So, this is a after hours event. So, similar to like after hours in the Walt Disney World theme parks from 9, 9 p.m. to 1 a.m. where it's gonna, there's gonna be some exclusive character meet and greets, a special fireworks show. Um, they lay on exclusive merchandise. Merchandise. Lots snacks. of special food. Got your key? Yes. Going down, going down, going down. Going down. Oh, no, <laughs> the after hours event doesn't actually start until 9 pm, and I think the park closes at 8 pm. So there's like a bit of a, an hour gap there, but we're allowed into the park from 6 pm. So we're going to go in, find some food. Yes, get some little foods. Treat ourselves maybe to an attraction or two if we've got time. But otherwise, just keep on the lookout for where things are going to be. So we want characters. If you happen to be coming to something like this, they actually have specific areas to check in. Uh, so these are the lines over here. So we've picked up a little map on the way in, and now we're going to get a wristband with these lovely cast members here. Hello. We've got a little lanyard as well. Woo! How cute is that? I think, I don't know, is this just for this evening? I think it's just like tell people we belong here. <laughs> we paid. $159, we paid. <laughs> Look at all the pictures. And all the characters we can be. Yeah, well, I'm assuming the hearts are like attractions for the evening. We really want to try some food that we can't get in Walt Disney World. So we're going to go to a place called the Bengal Barbecue, which I've heard good things about. 
that's in Adventureland. Over that way. The Bengal Barbecue. Let's have a, look, have a little look, see what we got. I feel like I've just been fleeced. Because, so, if I said this was 649, you might be like, oh, no, that's like a good. No, we've paid for two. It's 649 for that and 649 for that. Two little huskers of chicken. <laughs> it better be good, that's all I'm saying. <laughs> It's nice, but it's not 6.99 nice. No, it's nice, but it's not. <laughs> <laughs> what we have is character encounters and fat wops, entertainment, the pop-up bands, um, special food, and then yeah, you've got special foods and, and then the merch. merch. So we're currently around here. Um, I don't think most of this kicks off until 9 p.m. when the actual event starts. The fireworks are at 9.35. So, um, there's loads of things dotted around. There's nothing really in Star Wars Galaxy's Edge, which makes it a whole lot of sense. Yeah. Um, but, uh, yeah, A lot so. of the characters are in um, Fantasyland. It's so clever how, like, the realms change. Yeah, they do a very good job of it. Hats off to the Imagineers, if you're watching. And we're back in Disney World! <laughs> Dinner take two! We weren't terribly hungry, so I went and got us some kids' menus. So Gary's got a little Impossible Burger, which is quite cute. Oh, very cute. Is that a tangerine? And I've got a uh, little chicken chip, yep, yeah, with some macaroni and cheese. Giving me fruit! <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if this is the same for the adults' menu, but the kids' menu. The chicken is chicken thigh, and... I personally am not a big fan of like fatty meat, so I'm really disappointed by that. How's your burger? Carrots and I think they messed that up. <laughs> I genuinely feel like I've been fleeced. I've spent $40 for two chicken skewers, a handful of macaroni and cheese, a tangerine and half an impossible burger. The tangerine was nostalgic. Just. We tried to get dinner, it did not go to plan. Disneyland, you won this round. <laughs> there is resistance activity here. Have you seen anything suspicious? If you do, report it at once. I will. I'll cross anyone up. <laughs> Interplanetary travel is down. A pavement. <laughs> That's one of the funniest things you've said this summer, though. <laughs> a couple of the things can't go in the vlog. No. <laughs> oh, oh, that was easy. Yeah, sweet, sweet fantasy, baby. They're currently doing the projection version of Wondrous Journeys that we saw yesterday. So we're going to go to It's a Small World to see it.
used to crying. I was like, keep it together, keep it together. <laughs> right, now what? Uh, are we in Fantasyland? Ish. There is a photo spot here somewhere, a photo opportunity. Alright, we'll have a look for it. Oh, great music. Is this on Spotify? No. Hi Disney. If, if you're seeing this clip, it's because this song isn't on Spotify yet, and I'd love it. Listen up. Where are you at, girls? We have spoken to a few cast members who work the event. Uh, we've established that any sort of character meet and greet is going to be a very, very long line, and any sort of photo op is going to be a very, very long line. So we're just we're, we're deciding which line we want to choose at this moment in time. Yeah. Um, because a lot of them don't start till nine, but then some of them start early, and I think it's very hard coming here for the first time and actually knowing what's happening because obviously we're not regulars. Yeah, and, and there's a lot of like, there's a lot is of, it, isn't it happening? Yeah, and like the, the, the map doesn't say like, this starts at nine, this starts at eight. There's a magic carpet one here. Um, obviously we're not a couple, so we're gonna have to tell them. We're just friends. <laughs> just friends, they're making everyone like, please don't make us kiss. <laughs> Hi. Just as a small disclaimer, we're friends. <laughs> We're just getting a line for Small World. We just did the Aladdin photo pass there. Uh, if I like the pictures, here you go. If I don't like the pictures, you ain't gonna see them. So. One thing to remember is there's this little code on the yellow yes. band. You scan that with your phone to link the code to your account. Yes. You can get the pictures coming out. <laughs> I just had this like out of body experience where like in my head I went, welcome to the boats of love. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it looks like that, like in the Simpsons and stuff, like the love boat. Demon bear, demon bear. <laughs> <laughs> Gary's like, oh, the magic man is coming alive. Ooh, the magic man's alive. Which look at it. I don't even have it on. A phantom magic man. <laughs> Are you left hula girl or right hula girl? That's it, go. Shake it. <laughs> Shabble, they shabbles forever. Bring her back, girls. Oh, my God. <laughs> Amazing. Well, I'm the king of the Absolutely amazing. Right, um, the Fantasyland attractions are very quiet at the moment, so we're going to maybe do a couple of those. Um, we've got a few more minutes until the party actually starts, and then the fireworks are at 9.35! Woo! We're very looking forward to those. <laughs> Take her up. <laughs> no, that's down. No, no. that's up. No. <laughs> Even with the option of up and down, he still doesn't know what is doing. <laughs> <laughs> we got there in the end. I don't think it goes all the way. Oh, it's, it's going quite quickly, isn't it? Oh, I like it. <laughs> this tumbo is a bit wild. <laughs> it's a lot faster. This one hasn't been tamed. <laughs> It's very tight up here. My right bum cheek is clenching to try and stop myself from sliding into you and it's getting a bit sore. Well, I'm already crushed against the side. I love a carousel. Push hard. Good job it wasn't me, I'd be trapped in there. 
we've just found out that the uh, area that's just behind me, which is behind the castle, which includes Pinocchio, Snow White, Peter Pan's Flight and the Carousel, closes during fireworks. So uh, they've closed those attractions just before they start. Hello. Thank you. <laughs> Alright guys, uh, moving along here on the side. Me and a couple skips have had this debate. Do you guys think that's a crystal ball or a glass sphere out there? Shout it out if you don't. Anyone? Anyone? A crystal ball? Yeah, I just say it's either or. Oh. A lot of people ask, uh, how heavy is that thing? And I just say, oh, it's pretty light. <laughs> oh my god. That good? Oh god. And on your left here, look at that boa sitting in a tree. H-I-S-S-I-N-G. And finally, our last stop here at the Jungle Cruise, the gift shop. Yeah, Trader Sam, he's got a great wheel deal going on, and he'll make sure not to steer you in the wrong direction. Uh, if you folks had a good time today, just remember, my name is Skipper Peyton. If you guys did not have a good time today, all right. <laughs> Now uh, you were on an uh, outstanding crew. Now I'm getting to need you outstanding on the dock. Wah, wah, wah. <laughs> There was a joke that uh, Skipper Pete said right at the beginning that had me rolling with laughter. He basically said, uh, I'm going to give you some important safety information while I'm driving a boat backwards in the dark. <laughs> and I just, I loved it. I loved it. It was great. This is so cool. Beautiful. Yeah. I mean, it's a shame we're both single and we're looking at hearts everywhere, but you know. <laughs> We kind of knew that coming into this. There are very long lines for photos, and I suspect it's because you get photo pass included in the event. So a lot of people are trying to get like pictures with all the hearts and everything. We're in the Emporium. We're looking for exclusive merch. So this is the merch selection. This t-shirt is $39.99 and if I'm being really honest, I don't think that fabric is worth that price. You can literally see your fingers through it and there's, there's a magnet. No, there's a plastic ornament. How much? $20. $20? Mm. Or a die cut magnet, which is, you know, that's basically just printed. That's $14.99. I think that's, it's too much. That's all they've got there. And they did say that these sell out. Oh, yeah. So they usually get end up with just that. There is quite a lot riding on these fireworks. I'm hoping they're the best fireworks I've ever seen in my life. Fingers crossed, fingers crossed. Goodness, Minnie, you're looking fabulous. Look at that dress. Sorry, Mickey, I'm not flirting with you, missus. <laughs> Can I have a hug? Yeah? Bring it in. Oh, thank you so much. This right here is a line to get a picture in front of the castle. It is currently snaking all the way around there. 
to Fantasyland. I just want to give you a feel. The attraction wait times are very similar, if not exactly the same, to what they've been during the days when we've been here. But that's not the whole line, it starts back down there. I know. Hello, good evening. Very well, how are you? Oh, very well, thank uh, you. I'm Adam, it's nice to meet you. Uh, the United Kingdom. How exciting. Just over the water from you. Yes, I was going to say, not too far away from the streets of Paris. Hello, how are you doing? Very well, Phoebus. Phoebus? You're a taller in person. Oh, thank you. He <laughs> does have a towering stature, doesn't he? Just a tad. <laughs> Just met Esmeralda and Phoebus. Amazing. Gary, tick, tick, tick. Big, big fan, big, big fan of Hunchback of Notre Dame. Esmeralda was beautiful. Yep. Phoebus, Phoebus was, was lovely. Phoebus was lovely. Um, we're, what, what time is it? Time is just gone 11. 11. So, so two hours into the actual party. Yeah, we've decided to call it quits because we were tired already. It's very, very busy everywhere. Very, very busy. Um, we've kind of gone from like that side of the park to that side of the park to that side of the park. And with Gary's legs and everything. We're ready to go. Key question, is it worth the money? One, two, three. No. no. <laughs> it was very expensive for not a lot. How much was it again? $159 per person plus tax. And that's the same price as what you'd pay for a not so scary Halloween party or a uh, Christmas party where you get parade, you get up for fireworks, you get free snacks, you know? And you can still meet characters, but you're not waiting in. Well, the only characters you would wait that sort of long line for is Jack and Sally. But that's yeah, the Halloween party, yeah. yeah. So uh, that's based on our experience. At the end of the day, like if you are a local and you're coming all the time, you might think that this is the best thing since sliced bread. But actually, for someone who's traveling internationally and used like one of our days to actually use to come yeah. to this event really disappointed. We spoke to a lot of cast members and it seems that the event is geared towards people that come all the time. Um, it is an event if you love lines. <laughs> <laughs> or, or like you, you come here all the time and you're just looking forward to doing one character and if that's a price you're willing to pay all the power Fair to pay you. To you. I, I respect you and I hope you have a great time. I love you, <laughs> I enjoy you, I appreciate you. We are going back to the room because we are knackered. <laughs> I need this. Hooray! Oh, oh. Highlight of the day. Oh. <laughs> My highlight has been trying to film this clip because we've done it so many times because we're so tired. <laughs> what was your actual highlight of the My day? My actual highlight <laughs> was Phoebus and es Esmeralda. Good. And you know that because we've done this a yes. million times. <laughs> My highlight of the day was the one that just Yours was nachos, I nachos think. Nachos at lunch. I'm but psychic. I really enjoyed looking around the Grand Californian as well. And do you know oh. what? I love the Grand Californian so much. I could have snapped a piece off. And yeah, took it home we could me. stay there one day, maybe. But anyway, <laughs> <laughs> the, this is the hysteria of being this so is tired. The hysteria. Well, I really appreciate you watching the videos. We've met some lovely people who watched the videos today, so, including, including someone who waved from the Liberty Bell. Yeah. If so you we were don't that know person, who you are, but thank you for waving. If you were lovely. You were the Liberty Bell. <laughs> Anyway, so uh, we're going to leave you here. We hope you tune in for the next vlog. Don't forget to check out the description for all the fun stuff. Like this video if you enjoyed it. Subscribe to the future stuff. Thank you so much for watching. And we'll see you next time.